channel update, I guess. Have I shown my face on this channel yet? I don't think I have. But hi, <laughs> I'm Sade. This is my channel. Um, and I have not posted anything here for a while, and so I guess I wanted to record a quick channel update and just announce that I am back. I am gonna keep posting content on this channel, and I am very happy to be back. Um, the end of 2020 was definitely a crazy year for a lot of us. Um, I mean, the whole year was crazy. The end was crazy as well. Um, I had a lot of stuff going on that I decided to prioritize over posting content on this channel. Um, one of those things being um, this stray cat that uh, started showing up in my backyard, um, who I dubbed Ez. Um, short for Ezra and I ended up taking him in I ended up uh, spending a lot of my savings getting him treatment for his eyes because the reason I took him in um, he his eyes were so swollen they were rolling his eyelids were rolling in on themselves and he was um, essentially getting uh, like abrasions on his eyes from the constant like friction of like his eyelids rolled in it was really bad and I couldn't leave him out there and I took him in and like so much thank you to the vet who helped me um, and the clinic in my town that were super helpful and helped me take care of him um, Ezra come here come here Ezra come here pretty boy This is Ezra, my newest child. <laughs> um, yeah, so he was sick and I took him in and I mean, I, I shouldn't have in the sense that I uh, already have a cat who doesn't like other cats and Lady is slowly learning, learning to accept him. So look at that face. Um, but the universe was like, hey, you need to take this cat in, and so I did, and so that's that. Um, that took a lot of my attention and just having to keep tabs on him, and then I also moved into this new space. Um, my mother and I renovated the garage together, um, so now I have a proper uh, working space. I even have a little, like, couch area where I can watch movies and my bedroom is upstairs in this loft and I am super thrilled to be in this space. I'm super thrilled to start working in this space. I've kind of taken uh, this first month of January to kind of settle into it and it's definitely a work in progress. Um, I'll show you around in a little bit. <laughs> but. Uh, I, I'm just eager to start working on things, and I have already like made a few things while I've been in here. I made this cute little cat the other day. I'm actually gonna give this um, to the vet that helped me with Ezra, because um, she was super sweet and like super helpful. And yeah, that's just essentially where I am. Um, I am eager to start posting content here again. Um, I'm eager to share stuff that I do with you. I hope you're all doing okay. Um, the start of this new year has, was already pretty crazy, but um, I'm trying to be hopeful for the rest of the year. I don't expect to go anywhere. Um, my goals this year are really just to stay inside, uh, not get sick, and take care of myself and my cats and my family and, and keep in touch with my friends, make sure they're also doing well, and I hope you guys are also doing well. Um, like, there's only a few of you, but like I love you guys for, for those of you that come back and keep watching my stuff. For my friends that tune in and watch stuff, I love you guys. Um, but yeah, I just... I, I forced myself to like get on camera for this because I just kind of wanted to be open and honest uh, to let you guys all know that I am here to make things and do things that I love and I want to share those things with you um, so I hope you stick around and, and watch and um, I would love to make some friends through the content that I put out. It's been a very lonely year because uh, I did stay home. I 
I think I could probably, I could have probably listed the amount of times that I went out in 2020 to like one sheet of paper, to one like half sheet of paper. Um, so yeah, um, I would love to make some friends and not be so lonely this year and just, we'll see what comes of it, but I want to be hopeful. I have some things to start sharing really soon. Um, I am gonna keep sharing stuff with Mort. Um, and I will share a video about this thing here behind me. Um, but if you're curious about this, I would say go over to Creative Horror, uh, that YouTube channel. I managed some stuff there and I work with everyone there and we had a costume contest and that's what that's from so check that out um but i'll have more detail on like how i made that for you guys along with other things um yeah okay i'm rambling at this point but i love you guys and i can't wait to share more stuff with you guys please stay tuned and take care of yourselves please please um if you support white supremacy get the fuck off my channel this content is for you but everybody else i love you you're all welcome Fucking just take care of each other. Be kind to each other. Okay, I did I did say I would share my space a little bit, but here is this is more or less the same. My um L-shaped desk. Um got those shelves back up, but since here's here's this will change because I have to get rid of him. But my workspace, I still have this table to work on, but now I also have this workbench which is at, at standing height and that's really really nice for my back. Um, I have storage, books, my cameo, more things. This, I want to get these Ikea shelves to replace all this. Here's Ezra. Hey buddy. Ooh yeah. Wanna say hi? Oh, I love his face. I will, I'll have to talk more about Ezra later and share some of his more details of his story later on. But I got this little desk, which is kind of like my, my little writing table. Um, I have my typewriter right here so I can just prop it up and my um, uh, Surface Pro where I like to write on as well. I got my little whiteboard where details planning. Shout out to Crump because I really like his eye. And then up here is going to be like um, uh, just, just art like this. I'm gonna just put things that inspire me up here and probably also on my whiteboard which is why I have printed art from friends and gift art from friends and my own art of friends. I really miss my friends. <laughs> um, this whole space under here it completely needs to be reorganized. Um, it's a fucking mess but it, it'll do for now. It'll, it'll do. My shoes. And then this is, this is probably my most favorite space right now because this is, I bought my own couch. Um, that hurt, but I bought my own couch. There's Lady, Bubba Girl, and I can just watch here, watch movies with my cats here, and I mean, it's all a little bit of a color, but I'm super happy to just have room to work. And then up here is, I mentioned my bedroom's upstairs, and I guess I will show you guys a peek because I, I really love my little space up here. It's my little cozy den. And so there's my bed and like my uh, my collection of books and some of my figures are up here. It's also a working space. Um, a lot of my, I don't have a closet so I had to get this thing from Ikea. That behind there is the creepy door to the attic that I still need to paint and then cover up somehow. But yeah, um, that is my space. This is still the door that led into the garage and if to give you an idea of how terrifying the garage was, like think um, think like Murder Shack. <laughs> this is kind of, I still need to paint over this door, but I want to repair some of it first, like this here and this, uh, so that's, that's a thing. But everything else is more or less um, bueno and <sighs> well, let's, I just want 2021 to be a good year. I'm not expecting great things. I'm not expecting the best things. I'm not expecting to even see my friends. But you know what? I have a lot of stuff to also be grateful for. Um, and I can't wait to 
Let's see what comes this year. May it be good or bad, okay? Also, look at this warm mug plush that I got. I love it so much. Okay, all right, I'm done. Bye, guys. Thank you for watching.